Guys, what's happening? Eugene here. I hope you're all flowing. Come with us. Come into the flow of the next dimension. We gotta enter that dimension. There's the CN Tower dimension. It's really lovely down here. You guys should come to Toronto. Everybody come to Toronto because there's lots to see, there's lots to do. There's lots of perfume to buy. That's the best part. There's so much perfume to buy. That's where I'm going to buy perfume. It is Christmas Eve. I haven't bought any perfume for myself. It's been since uh, Frederick Moll's Heaven Can Wait. It's the last fragrance I bought. It's been a few months, maybe. At least a month. Maybe more. But uh, I've done all my Christmas shopping. Oh, I've got some gifts to wrap, but um, I've done all that. So I've got a little bit of time before retail closes. I've got about an hour and 40 minutes. So I'm on my way to Le Labo Boutique. There's two boutiques in Toronto. I'm on the way. So interesting that Le Labo's got two boutiques, but, and Guerlain had closed theirs down. How does, how is that possible? How does this happen? How does Le Labo have two, two boutiques in Toronto and Guerlain closed theirs down? I don't get it. You're telling me Le Labo sells more perfume than Guerlain? There's no way. There's there, there there can't be. There can't be a way. Um, but yeah, Toronto's got two. We're lucky to have two. So thank you, Le Labo, for having two boutiques here. I'm on the way to the Queen Street West. I love the I love Queen Street West. So um, that's my that's kind of like my stomping grounds when I come to Toronto. It's such an interesting place. So I'm going to pick up the new Le Labo, the lavender, the Lavande 31. And it's this really musky, clean, fresh, cottony, like laundered musk lavender. And it's got a really sparkling accord to I love that sparkling stuff. <laughs> you know, like glitter and lights and shiny and new stuff, right? Um, yeah, it was kind of catchy. It had something that caught me um caught my attention I only tried it once but I'm going I'm going to grab it it is my gift to myself because I deserve it yes I do I am going to gift it to myself because man I'm just that guy you know I'm just that guy I uh, I love that guy so he definitely deserves it and this is what he's getting Lavant. all right so here's Queen Street West Lavanda 31 and um, yeah so I hope everybody is having a great holiday Christmas or whatever you celebrate um, hopefully you're with good people good connection good energy uh, if you're alone hopefully you have a pet if you don't have a pet hopefully you have um, good books good movies a good connection back to yourself so yeah, enjoy Christmas. I'm going to enjoy Christmas. I've got my boys tomorrow. I've got all three of my boys. I've got. I've always had my boys on Christmas. I've never had a day, a Christmas day, without my kids, and that's. I, it's a miracle how that's worked out, or, or it's just worked in my favor. But it's. You know, I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful that I get to see them every Christmas. Um, it's important, like super important to me. Uh, yeah, brilliant. I love that. So. I hope all of you guys enjoy your Christmas. Drop your drop your sense of the day down below. Let's see what you're all wearing. This place is great. I wish I could show you this place. Like here, check this out. Let's check it out. The, like the scenery is really great. The people is great. This is um in Queen Queen Street West. Toronto was ranked the number two street in the world on Vogue's like chicest, chicest streets in the world list. I don't, I'm not sure who came first, but Toronto, Toronto's Queen Street West was number two. I think it was a place in like Denmark or Finland. Hmm. I'll have to look it up, but yeah, it's really fat. I love coming down here people are great and there's so much to do like so much there's music if you're in the music there's tons of live bands there's street bands there's there's great food um 
there's always something artistic going. They've got tons of museums down here. They've got architecture, they've got libraries, they've got um, clubs, Rolling Stones, when they would come to Toronto, they would they would like wind up, their tune, they'd tune up their guitars here. They'd find one of these, the Horseshoe Taverns or or Lee's Palace or whatever, I don't know, and they'd tune up their, their guitar here before they go play in the big stadium, so. It's pretty wild. Can you imagine walking into this small bar underground and there's like Mick Jagger and Keith Richards just like strumming away? You know, that's how cool it is. Uh, they've got outdoor skating rinks or one. They've got one rink. They've got one outdoor skating rink at the city hall there. It's just really cool. It's wild. Uh, the people are the most, you know, the people here is what makes everything great. The people everybody's so unique in this way like they just dress to be whoever they are you know not looking to impress and and some people are dressed like so it, it, it feels like it's so th just thrown together but they look great you know <laughs> everything just works it's weird as hell some people look super weird and strange but everything is so cool how it comes together you know, it's so art. It's so it's very really creative. That's what I love. Is everything's so colorful and um, different, different. There's so many like nooks and crannies here, and so much to discover, including mushrooms. I've got some mushrooms here. But if you're ever in Toronto, Queen Street West is a must, 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 must visit. It's absolutely brilliant. Um, the boutique's not far. It's just around the corner here. But yeah, I'm going to go into the boutique. I am grabbing my lavand. I am going, I'm going to head to the gym after this. I hope the gym is open later. And uh, I'm going to do my squats. I'm going to give myself squats for Christmas. Squats are the best thing in the world, especially if you want to move blood. If you want to move blood and feel good, move some breath. Squats are great for that. Alrighty, there's tons of churches down here as well. Tons of churches. Architecture is great. They've got, they've got something for everybody here. Street art, they've got a lot of street art. I got the cops patrolling the street. Cappers. All right, guys, I'm going to chill, but I'll talk to you later.